Let me set the scene for you guys. All the the story I've told one time on social media, but I didn't tell it intera interactively. So I feel like a I feel like a lot of people didn't have a chance. Uh, Use Trippin' Shorty also dropped the sub. Thank you so much, Use Trippin' Shorty. I'm really mad at myself for this story, by the way. I'm really upset with myself about this story. So, if you guys want to hear the rest of this, click the link in the bio. Come to my Twitch. My username is Matt's underscore all right, and there's a link in my bio. Let me put the music on. I want to make sure I tell this right. You guys will tell me if I don't tell it right, all right? Witty Onions donated $10. Witty Thank you Witty underscore so much, Onions dude. donated $10. We all love you. Thank you for sharing your stories. So in 2011, I was, so I was somebody who survived in my squad. So uh, we had a squad of about nine or ten guys. Kate X under, uh, Kate underscore X zero. Thank you so much for the sub. Thank you. I appreciate you. Shirtless Matt. All right, I'll take off my shirt right now, guys. <laughs> All right, so we had. Let's start off the story here. I think. We had a mass cas in my squad. A mass cas is a is a mass casualty, and that means that we lost three guys in one day. And that's hard because in a squad of nine Marines, and these guys have known each other for years, you just lost memories. You lost life, right? Dave, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate your handsome face. The guys who are left were guys like me, and then other guys who who weren't ready to be in an infantry squad with one hour of sleep, six hours of combat, one hour of diarrhea, and then hopefully smoking a cigarette in between there. We got sent to a police checkpoint. So if you don't know, usually you live in something that's kind of like a a, a patrol base, or at least a FOB, a forward operating base. A forward operating base has around maybe 100, 150 people. A patrol base usually has a platoon, which is around maybe 40 people tops. Delightful girl, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I saw you drop subs the other night. And um, bits, thank you so much. I appreciate you. So living on this patrol base, you know, you got 30 or 40 guys. But then when you get sent to... A checkpoint, a patrol base, I'm sorry, a checkpoint, a VCB, a vehicle checkpoint, you're so undermanned. What you have to do is allow the Afghan nationals to help you. Over there, we have the, Ash the Afghan police and the Afghan army to help us. And these guys are our allies. They're going to help us. They're not going to betray us. These guys are usually extremely vetted. All right? These guys, like, when they come to join us, these guys are usually former Taliban who have been shot, captured, and don't ever want to go back to the Taliban because they feel like they've been betrayed by being left behind. Or these guys have shot and killed Taliban members before. Like, these guys are trustworthy. So I'm there with my squad, who we had our mass casualty. We lost so many good guys and got replaced by, like, combat cooks and people who didn't know what to do like how it actually worked witty onions thank you so much for the sub I appreciate your handsome face so while we're living there we're living with the Afghan police and the one guy I can tell you his name is commander he had been shot in the face hey Matthew my neck keeps dropping I'm gonna go we'll be posting this on YouTube I want to hear the rest while I'm at work Yes, I will. I'll cut it up and put it on YouTube. I love you, Mama Sita. Shout out, you guys. My YouTube uh, username is Maths underscore. All right. Everybody who's brand new here, please comment first time so you can actually get welcomed in. Woody Onions, thank you so much again for dropping a subscription to help support the stream. I appreciate you. So we're there with a former Taliban member named Commander who had been shot in the face by British Royal Marines. And he hated the Taliban. And the reason why he hated the Taliban is because they left him to die. Because he couldn't sit up straight on the motorcycles as they are getting away after the firefight. Shots everybody who's commenting first time. We're there. We're tired. We have these combat replacements. But we get lucky. 
Why do we get lucky all of a sudden? Why do we get lucky? Because a brand new squad of Afghan police show up to come help us. Shout to Small Town Mom Zero Two who donated a sub. Thank you so much for dropping a sub. That really helps me. I really appreciate you. Uh, thank you so much for dropping a sub to help support the stream. We're so happy because here comes these brand new squad of Afghan police. Uh, is it McCann? Mechanic? It's a hard one. Thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. As soon as these guys show up, Commander, the Afghan policeman who had been shot in the face before, he tells me in particular, because I spoke Pashto. That's the language they primarily speak in southern Afghanistan. I didn't speak it fluently, but I spoke it, uh, I spoke it enough to understand. And essentially, what he was trying to tell me, he just spoke English eventually. He said, Jimmy, that's what they call me. He says, no good. And he points at them. I say, I'm 22. I say, what do you mean no good? What, what are you talking about? No good. Time goes by, and we're living with these four, five, six guys from the Afghan police that have been sent to us miraculously as we're under man. Shouts to Soldier, who dropped the sub live on Twitch. Soldier, thank you so much for the sub, helping support the stream. We're sitting there super thankful, really happy, and this Afghan police commander keeps telling me, no good. But luckily, the guys who are with us are so nice to me. They're so nice to me, so I think to myself, Commander must be tripping. Commander must be tripping because I think these guys are great. These guys are so nice to me. I love them. A shout to Bullet the Dom 859 who dropped this up. Bullet the Dom, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you, handsome face. If you guys got gifted a sub, let me try and skip through these pictures here. I want to show you the actual picture of the Afghan, uh, the Taliban member that I was like friends with. Hold on. You like shirtless Matt? What do you guys think about shirtless Matt, you little slut? <laughs> Takashi, I see you. Both the Dom, again, five subs. That's incredibly generous, dude. I don't deserve that. Uh, thank you so much. Hold on. Here's me when I'm younger. I start making friends with these guys. As, <laughs> and as I'm making friends with these guys, the commander gets more and more angry at me. Time goes by. A couple days go by. And eventually, this guy who you're seeing starts losing his temper a little bit more and more with the Marines that are with us. About curse words. Shout out to Wicked Wisdom who dropped the sub live on Twitch. Thank you so much, Wicked Wisdom. And again, both Dom, five subs. It really helps me out, dude. Thank you so freaking much, man. Zoom in for science. I might. Well, maybe I'll zoom in for delightful girl who just dropped five subs. Thank you so much, delightful girl. Thank you so much. I love you so much, Mamacita. All right, hold on. I'll show you more shirtless Matt real quick. Maybe I'll just on the stream. So here's the thing: in Afghan culture, you if if you curse at them, they're assuming the worst. Shout out to all my veterans who are in the chat right now. Like all you were, you've always been so handsome. Oh, Lizzie, I thought you were saying you were so handsome. I was like. I thought I'm more handsome now than back then. I feel like I just look like. I would like grind and finish in like 42 seconds. Like if you look at that picture of me, I feel like I would like have my pants on and finish accidentally. Now though, I look like I would like walk you around the room with a belt. Good dog. <laughs> So ugly. <laughs> so ugly. It's 47 seconds. So this guy who's in the picture, this is an Afghan police uniform too, by the way. Everybody who's watching, uh, that's an Afghan police uniform, believe it or not. If you see the blue, Afghan police grind and finish to say Dolly. Um, and you can see he wanted to take this picture with me. He wanted to be my friend. Like this guy wanted to be around me. So time goes on. And it's about a week and... This guy and his friends are getting more and more angry with us and less kind to us. Eventually, one of them actually, are you ready for this? He pulls an AK on us. Which is insane, by the way. Like, pulling an AK on somebody who's supposed to be on your side is like, you can't shoot them. 
I know what you're thinking. No justification of deadly force, hostile intent. Shut up. I know that sentence too. But when you're sitting there with five of these Afghan policemen and one of them pulls out an AK because you said mother effer, you're thinking it's like a Mexican showdown. There's going to be salsa everywhere. <laughs> you guys click the link in the bio. Hear the story live on Twitch. My username is Matt's underscore right. The link is in the bio. Marine Boeing, thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate you. 200 bits from Marine Boeing. All right. There's going to be salsa everywhere. Everybody who's dropping subs and bits, again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll make sure I thank you at the end of the stream. Uh, I want to do something special for you guys. Maybe I'll do like um, a Discord voice chat just for subscribers tonight or something like that. Um, I really appreciate you. So one of them pulls out an AK on us and we're able to, all right, everyone just relax. We're not going to curse anymore. We're not going to, right, everyone relax. The police commander, the guy who had been shot in the face, comes up to me again and he points at this guy and he says, Jimmy, no good. No good. Pat in the back. Shout out to Melon. Thank you so much for the sub. And he had told us they were Taliban, but for some reason, I don't know why. Like, why didn't we believe it? Like, why didn't we believe it in, in our mind? You guys have to ask yourselves that. Like, in my opinion, I feel like we might, we should, maybe should have gotten in trouble. Squash Dragon, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you, Squash Dragon. Uh, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, the next morning, this is my fault. I never talk about this, by the way. This is really embarrassing for me. Okay, guys? I never talk about this. That's how you guys know I'm really truthful, though, is I tell you the full story. I never try and make myself look good. So, you guys are about to hear something really, really... No, 25 is not too old to join the Marines. You guys are about to hear something really, really embarrassing about me. Shadow, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. Awesome face. All right. The next morning, Shadow again, thank you, thank you, thank you. The next morning, I'm on the rooftop of this small police station that we're staying at, okay? Don't make fun of me. I swear, I will I will kill you all. This is a weird way to eat Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> See, Valtteri, you're eating Fruity Pebbles? So I'm on top of this police station because I'm on watch. And I hear someone coming up the ladder. Shout out to Brady. Brady, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. You're amazing. I hear someone come up the ladder, and here's this guy, Adam Sandler, only without the glasses, right? He comes up, and he sits next to me. Shout out to Shadow, who dropped another sub. Thank you so much, Shadow. Sits, this is real, all right, hold on. Shut up! You guys better not make fun of me! Shout out to Ginger, thank you so much for the. <laughs> he comes up the ladder, and he sits right next to me. And he says, Jimmy... Jimmy, we go patrol. And I was like, yeah, what the fuck ever, bro? I don't care. Do you have cigarettes? By the way, do you have cigarettes? I need a cigarette. Do you have a cigarette? I've been out of cigarettes for like two days. He's like, okay, we, we, we patrol. You okay? I'm like, yeah, I don't care. He's like, okay. Look, look, Jimmy. Soda. And he gives me a six-pack of Coca-Cola. Squash Dragon, thank you so Squash much. Squash Dragon donated $50. Matt, just came over from your TikTok like I've been meaning to, and I just want you to know that I appreciate you, brother. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant... My bad, Squash Dragon. I thought you meant something else. Squash Dragon's like, I want my $50 back. <laughs> Squash Dragon, thank you so much for the $50 donation. I wouldn't be able to be here if it wasn't for you. All right. Thank you. Again, can we get hashtag love you in the chat for Squash Dragon? Guys, please remember, I stream four days a week. So he's like, he gives me soda. He gives me soda. You're going to want to screen record this, by the way, because I'm never telling this story again unless this is in my book because there are a lot more small details I'm not telling because I don't want to, like, keep interrupting to thank you, people. He gives me, like, a six-pack of, like, I don't, I think it was high C. Like orange high C cans, like small high C scan, high C cans, and I'm like, all right, 
Thanks for the soda. I needed a cigarette, dick. <laughs> Shout out to all my people who know what pine lights are. <laughs> you people? <laughs> so, he leaves with his four or five guys that he came in with. And I'm like... Tastes like squash dragon. Delicious. No, I'm like, all right, have a good one. All right. Like 45 minutes go by. Are you guys ready for this? Like 45 minutes go by. I hear... I was like, what's going on down there? It's me soda chili day. Soda. Where's me soda? Soda. What do you say? What do you say? <laughs> Fucking soda. Taliban. Oh, what's going on, man? What happened? <laughs> Shout out to H535, uh, HF350 who dropped the sub live on Switch. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> Fucking Taliban! Commander, if you guys don't know, Commander who had been shot in the face, the guy who's been telling us this whole time, they're Taliban. This guy is Taliban. These guys who pulled an AK on you are Taliban. They're undercover Taliban. The day after they pulled the AK on us, they decided it was time to skedaddle. You guys are laughing at me thinking, you're so stupid. You're so dumb. Well, it turns out, hear me out, guys. Don't tell anyone I told you this, okay? You guys better you got you guys better promise you're not gonna tell anyone. <laughs> I don't think you guys better not tell anyone what I did. So it turns out the undercover Taliban decided they kind of blew their cover when they pulled an AK on us. Go figure. And it was time to leave. But they should leave when somebody that they liked was actually on watch. That way they'd have a better chance of that person not being sus suspicious. <laughs> but maybe we should bribe him. <laughs> maybe we should give him soda. But we don't have any soda. <laughs> so let's steal this douchebag soda that keeps trying to rat us out that we're Taliban. <laughs> Actor dropped 200 bits. Oopsie whoopsie. Taliban, he make a fuckery. So. I might have been bribed with soda. To let Taliban escape. I don't know what to say. I got distracted. <gasps> oh no, I have the hiccups. Guys, I'm adorable. He, look how adorable I am. Look at me. Don't you guys just want to make me your little submissive, breedable slave and slap me around and tell me? Yeah. Cry with your little PTSDs, you little bitch. That's a true story. I let this guy and his friends escape. I could have pulled my weapon and they would have pulled theirs and I could have just mowed them down. But I watched them leave as I was frustrated because I didn't want soda. I wanted a cigarette. So, Shadow BTV. So, the end of the story. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> I lie <laughs> about the soda and I hide the soda. So, the, the, to this day, Taliban, the, the commander, the guy who's my friend, he thinks that the, he thinks that the Taliban took his sodas with him.
I he nobody knows that I let all of these Taliban members escape. By the way, I was the guy on watch. <laughs> I got bribed with soda. I drank a, one, angry that it wasn't a cigarette. And when the guy was like, "They're Taliban. They're Taliban." I told you guys they're Taliban the whole time, and now they took my soda and they left. I was like, "That's crazy." I didn't even see him leave. I think they left before my watch. <laughs> they must have left while I was sleeping, cause I didn't see. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't even see him go. At 4:57 a.m. After giving me a six pack of high C sodas. <laughs> Shout out to Brady. Brady, thank you so much for the sub. Yeah, that's it. Just so all of you know. I don't care who you vote for. I don't care if you're Democratic or Republican. It was me. I'm the fool that was bribed with the sodas. Melch, thank you so much for being here. It was me. That's the story. I never, I never really include that part. Guys, I'm so seducible. You guys could totally seduce me. All you have to do is touch right here. And give me a soda, and I'll be like, "Oh, holy moly, that feels wonderful!" 